So what's going on guys, I'm Black Ops Amazing, welcome back to another video where today we're going to be taking a look at our next map within Vanguard Zombies, which I think we all know by now since I made a video on this about a month ago, but during Season 1 Reloaded we got some brand new radios, intel, and I suppose you could say our very first easter egg within the game, which confirm pretty much where the next location for our Zombies map is going to be, and that's Egypt. But of course we know that Zombies this year is slightly different, instead of us having maps we have regions and hubs so even though yes for our next zombies map in season two we more than likely are going to egypt when i say that i mean that's going to be the hub location just like the hub the main area in duranfangus stalingrad our next hub location is going to be egypt and then the areas or different regions we can travel to again just how in duranfang the main hub is stalingrad but we can travel to Marve. Paris, the swamps of Shinonuma. When the Egypt hub location comes, I'm imagining there'll be new regions for us to travel to as well. And we know one of those is going to be the Dark Ether, as was confirmed by Triarch recently. So anyway, as I mentioned, as a part of Season 1 Reloaded, which came out about a week and a half ago now, I didn't cover this on the channel straight away, simply because I was waiting to see if Triarch would add any new radios into Duran Fank. Just like they did in Season 1. I thought maybe they'd do it in Season 1 Reloaded, but they didn't. So let's go ahead and take a look at exactly what this new Easter egg in quotation marks in Duran Fang is and what it tells us. I'm not going to go on and explain exactly how you do it because I'm assuming most of you watching this by now already have done it or will know. And I'm more focusing on the story being told, but pretty much in Duran Fang you will find these portals and when you go up to them and interact with them, you will hear people or things speaking. And who exactly will you hear? Well, that is Gabriel Kraft, who I know is the demonologist. He is working with us, as well as the artifacts, to defeat Cortifex and Von List. We get to hear him having a conversation with the artifacts, or the Elder Gods, talking about what they plan to do next. Apologies for not greeting you face to face, but you may recall I am magically sealed in here by a page from the Tome of Rituals. You've seen the Tome by now, out there, on its rather unusual pedestal. Perhaps you've explored how it can further empower your demonic partners. During my servitude to Devarheit, I track the tome scattered pages around the world. The book out there is what we managed to restore. But some pages are still loose. You just saw one, secured by those magic anchors. What I sensed as a void was no ordinary spell. Von List and Cortifax clearly don't want us to get it. Which means, that page may be the key to defeating Von List. Then we must go back at once, and this time fight harder! Oh, Destroyer. Can you not recognize a no-win scenario? We must rethink our strategy. And what do you propose, Nauticus? How will the Conqueror overcome the fact that mortal flesh is weak? If you think so little of them, Saraxes, why do you crave their attention so much? Stop it! Bickering gets us nowhere! Just... just give me some time to think this over. Soldiers of Nauticus, let us discuss our tactical dilemma in private. I have placed a speaking stone in what you call the apartments. Go find it. You may have to clear obstructions to get there. Understood? You're here. Good. At least you can follow orders. Oh, don't flatter yourself, Nauticus. No one saluted you since Cortifex stripped you of command. Let the Conqueror speak. I want to hear how he intends to shield these humans from certain death. As a matter of fact, Invictor, a shield is exactly what I propose. <sighs> it would have to be stronger than anything a mortal forge can produce. Even in this age. Remember the portals? Our mission of eight. Oh, you mean that commander of the Night Legions, don't you? What was his name again? His name is forgotten. 
Cortifex saw to that as part of his punishment. But his shield is still somewhere in the dark ether. Finding and awakening it may require more power than the four of us combined. This is Kraft. Something unexpected has occurred here. Return to my office at once. You see it, yes? Yet another new portal has appeared. Nauticus, did any of you summon it? No, Professor. But it appears to lead somewhere outside the barrier spell trapping us here. I think I may know what this is. We have sent many messages to the Dark Aether requesting help. Has someone finally answered? Not just someone, Invictor. Can you feel her? Faint, but definitely her. Who are you talking about? With whom have we made contact? The Kana, the last. All is well, Gabriel. She will come as a friend. I can't believe, of all our brethren on the other side, she would decide to help us. Well, she always did keep to herself. But who among us has more reason to hate Cortifex? Her entire clan, hunted down by his assassins. Their sacred forests, reduced to ash. She still needs to complete her artifact, or she will join us by now. All we can do... Is wait. She is trying to tell us something with this portal. The desert that lies beyond must be our next front in the war against Cortifex. But only with Vercana's help can we pass through that portal and proceed with the plan Nordicus proposed. And then von List is in for a rude surprise. Let's get back to work, my allies. I will alert you once our new friend arrives. Yes? So Kraft tells us he is sealed inside of this portal by the Tomb of Rituals. Kraft starts talking to the artifacts about how they can defeat Von List and Court Effects. And Bellicor tells us that someone new will be joining us. Obviously, that's going to be one of the new field upgrades that we're going to be getting within Season 2, I assume. But first, before Vakana can join us, she needs to create her artifact. Anyway, after a few more irrelevant conversations between the characters, again, Bellicor tells us that this new Elder God, Vakana, who's going to be joining us, is trying to tell us something with the portal we find. And that message she's trying to share is, the desert that lies beyond is the next front in the war against Cortifex. But only with Vakana's help can we get there. So that confirms to us, along with some previous radios we've heard, that Egypt is in fact the next location we are going to. What we do know is, for one reason or another, Egypt is more important than any other location we've seen in Zombies so far to Von List, compared to any other of Von List and Cortifex's operations, whether it be in Sheen Hanuma or Stalingrad, there is something in Egypt that Von List doesn't want us to find. And from what we've also heard, whatever's there could be the key to stopping Cortifex and Von List for good. Oberführer Von List, to all the Wahrheit personnel operating in Mervie, France in Paris, and in the swamp known to locals as Shinonuma. First, your service is exemplary. The dimensional weak spot at the windmill site is already receiving vital support from the Dark Aether. The archaeological dig at Shinonuma is yielding important insights about the entities aiding the enemy, and preparations atop the Hotel Royal will ensure that all of Paris will soon experience a very different sort of nightlife. Be advised that another area of operations is underway. You may hear radio traffic from our unit in the eastern desert of Egypt. Theirs is a mission vital to protecting our most valuable ally, Herr Cortifex. Requests from this task force get top priority. So far... Kraft's little band of guerrillas have not targeted that operation, and I intend to keep it that way. Continue with your duties, my loyal soldiers. Soon the whole world will be at our feet. 
So there we go. It really isn't all that much. Like I said, the reason why I didn't cover this earlier is because I really did expect us to get some new radios or something like that in season one reloaded, but we didn't. However, as I mentioned at the beginning, next up, we are going to Egypt and we also know one of the new regions we'll be able to travel to is within the Dark Ether. I do imagine the Egypt hub is just going to be another map taken from the multiplayer, the one that actually takes place in Africa. I can't remember what it's called, but yeah, there we go. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. As always, hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, drop a like rating. Make sure you are subscribed to stay up to date with the latest videos on the channel. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.